You know, I'm from a quiet boom state. I'm from a quiet boom state. In 20... On the 10th of December, 2016, the tragedy struck in, in a Kwaibom state. A church in a Kwaibom state collapses. My brother-in-law died in that accident. 2016, my sister has been suffering she went there with her husband. She was lucky. She got lucky. She escaped with her barely. She barely escaped with her life. She has a wound, an iron, in her legs now. Some way they put iron inside our legs for the tie here. She has been having pains, suffering, and she's taking care of her children alone. She hasn't been paid for months now the government hasn't really done anything to help the survivors because if they don't do something I foresee them I foresee them in my sister's life everything where my sister they do now we they support them do you guys know why I'm saying this why I brought this story up do you guys know why I am saying this why I'm telling you guys, why I'm reminding you guys of this incident it was in the news, it was on social media everywhere. I lost a brother-in-law in that incident. The government, a private state government, hasn't really done anything to help the survivors. Because if they don't do something, I foresee them in the life of my sister, my elder sister. Because now she lost her husband. And most of the things where they, she, they do, now we, the siblings, they take care of her. Where to make her bring that story up, they say. A quiet room stayed just on fail the 30, before I miss here, a 32 billion Naira International Worship Center. A 32 billion Naira International Worship Center. Make her repeat them. A quiet boom state government has just unveiled the 32 billion Naira International Worship Center. In 2016, a church been collapsed in a quiet boom state. A church building collapsed in a quiet boom state in 20, on the 10th, before I miss Nyan, on the 10th of December 2016. Over more than a hundred people lost their lives in that incident including my brother-in-law may his soul and their souls rest in peace up till today the government of Akwai Bomb State haven't done anything to help the survivors to help the survivors the survivors of that incident before I begin the mother grammar here but the state is just unveiled unveiled a 32 billion naira International Worship Center. I'm Henry Krakhaus. This is Mponi Soup. Make that, let the let that sink into you, the viewer. This is Mponi Soup, the show where we they try to help fellow Nigerians. Um, the contacts, my contacts there on the screen. If you get problem, if you need help, if you need assistance, anywhere, any shape, form, do not hesitate to contact me. I will get back to you. I will talk. We know me and you could talk. I could see how I could fit help. I know one stress father and I know one yarn father or I know one stress father on that church issue thing because I know say the level where them don't indoctrinate us you know the level where them don't brainwash us you know if it speak on religion you know if it speak on religion make I repeat them you know if it speak on religion when it comes to Nigerians 